Hello everyone and welcome back to today's weather video. So it is currently Saturday evening and we are talking about Winter Storm Orlena. It is currently making its way into the mid uh, Midwest and everything going over into the Great Lakes and the Ohio River Valley. This storm will be making its way over into the East Coast. The Mid-Atlantic will be affected over into the Northeast. Okay, so quickly, <clears throat> let's pinpoint a couple locations that are going to see some snow out of this. Chicago, okay, we'll be seeing maybe up to 10 or plus inches of snow. Indianapolis, Columbus, and places north over into Cleveland, southwards of Detroit could be seeing the swath of heavy snow and everything upwards maybe 10 inches. Places north and south of there could be just seeing a couple inches. Now going over into Sunday, tomorrow morning and everything, that's where the storm is going to be making its presence here on the mid-Atlantic coast. Winter storm warnings as of right now, 8 p.m. on Saturday evening were posted for parts of mid-Atlantic coastal regions, basically the whole entire place. The immediate actual coastline of the Mid-Atlantic from New Jersey down into Delmarva going into coastal parts of Virginia and the northeastern part of North Carolina. They're under winter, winter weather advisories, but west of there, including Philadelphia, Baltimore, D.C., Richmond, Roanoke, Virginia, going into the Appalachia of Pennsylvania into the West Virginia parts um, they're under winter storm warnings. These places could see upwards of 6 to 10 inches of snow, maybe more in the higher terrain. However, going into the actual northeast where we're going to see the basically rain and snow line set up again. This winter storm Arlena is no exception to the actual infamous rain and snow line. D.C., Baltimore, Philadelphia, New York. Again, this is where we have trouble forecasting where we're going to see heavier snow or lighter snow, depending on where the actual storm sets up. As of right now, a lot of forecasts are placing the storm out here just east of the um, outer banks of North Carolina. After that, it just scooting northeastward, kind of paralleling actual um, northeast, basically. Um, New England and the Mid-Atlantic. So this is going to bring a lot of moisture back over to the west and we're going to see a lot of higher amounts of actual snow accumulations into parts of New York, a lot of eastern Pennsylvania, and then a lot of northern Maryland, northwestern Virginia, and parts of West Virginia. Now for the actual major actual cities along the I-95 corridor, we're expecting at least five to 10 inches of snow from DC up to New York. However, depending on the actual track of the storm, if it tracks a little westward, then we're gonna see more of a rain and snow mix, lesser accumulation. If it tracks a little eastward out into the actual um, Atlantic, we'll see more of that higher snow chance of 10 inches. But that's what the forecast is going as right now. Again, Saturday evening, 8 p.m. That's the actual forecast. Again, it will change as the actual storm develops here off of the Atlantic coastline. So again, this is not a final actual like, oh, you are definitely gonna see this amount of snow and ice. It's just a forecast. We are expected to see ice in the main Atlantic, especially into the Virginias and the Carolinas over the next couple of days due to the fact we're gonna have warmer moisture overriding the actual colder layer of air. So we are going to have more of an ice event into the Virginias and the Carolinas. That may spread a little northward depending on the actual track of the storm or that may actually be a bit more south depending on the actual storm. A lot of the actual snow and not actual rain and change over is going to not really occur into eastern parts of New York and Pennsylvania and a lot of New Jersey, at least the western parts of New Jersey. So we're not really expected to see a change of, of actual rain and snow in places like Philadelphia and New York. We're mainly expecting a snow event for you all upwards of 12 inches. 
The concern is down here, south of the Mason-Dixon line. You know the drill, Mid-Atlantic, Baltimore, DC, come on. We know what's going on. We just have to wait and see. But the current forecast is calling for, again, at least five or more inches of at least snow in the district. But we could see a change over of a wintry mix, which includes some rain, sleet and freezing rain for a time Sunday night going into Monday. The storm will lift northeastward into southern New England. So a lot of southern New England will stay mostly snow for this event. So places like Boston, Providence, and Hartford, you're expected to see 8 to 12 inches of snow going a little further into the uh, New England area, about five to eight inches of snow. There is not really expected any change of, of any winter precipitation. It should be an all snow event for you all northern places. So that is what we're seeing right now with Winter Storm Arlena. Again, tomorrow on Sunday, I will be in Tyson's Corner, Virginia, and I will do an update video from the hotel I will be staying at, and I look forward to seeing you all then tomorrow and everything so until then um yeah fingers crossed that we actually get some snow flurries here in dc hopefully and stay safe if you are driving out tomorrow please be careful but if you do not have a drive tomorrow stay home stay safe and we'll give another weather update as soon as we can good night everyone